It looks like Prince Harry is really feeling the heat lately, and we've got all the juicy details for you. Prince Harry learned a tough lesson in London during the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games. He was all alone. His wife, Meghan Markle, didn't even bother to join him and his family, who he's had a tumultuous relationship with for years, kept their distance. Prince Harry's cousins, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie, skipped his event in London to avoid stirring up more drama within the royal family. Despite their close bond with Harry, they were noticeably absent from the event at St. Paul's Cathedral last Wednesday. Royal commentator Richard Fitzwilliams explained on GB News that Beatrice and Eugenie wouldn't have attended without King Charles' approval. He noted, they wouldn't have been expected to be there because it would have highlighted a split in the royal family. Fitzwilliams further added that even with their strong relationship with Harry, Beatrice and Eugenie wouldn't have gone to the event without consulting King Charles. If any royal family members attended, it would have been seen as a division, he said. Recent reports indicate that Harry is feeling quite lonely in America, where he lives with Meghan Markle and their two children. Royal expert Phil Dampier suggested that Meghan might be isolating Harry from his friends and family, adding to his loneliness. He's quite isolated in California, Dampier mentioned in an interview on GB News. Dampier continued, saying that Harry's lack of close friendships might be affecting him negatively. He doesn't have a group of mates to unwind with, Dampier noted, hinting that Harry might be overly dependent on Meghan, who seems to control which social events he attends. Harry was recently spotted looking bored at Beyoncé and Katy Perry concerts, further fueling these claims. Entertainment commentator Mark Borman echoed these sentiments, suggesting that Harry longs for his old life and misses his close friends in London. According to Borman, Harry doesn't consider the people he's met in Hollywood as his true friends, and his real circle is back in London. So, what do you think? Is Harry's loneliness taking a toll on him? Do you believe Meghan is isolating him? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below.